Okay, but seriously, does anybody remember how I got up here? Um, I'll see you sometime. in the car on a nice warm dry day and thankfully it's not too sunny and I know that sounds silly because we always want the sunshine but for this is the first time I'm hitting record on my new iPhone 11 so I'm in the car which um, as usual gives me that unfortunate shakiness so I'm hoping there's gonna get um, a little bit of stabilization at some point either in post or with this new 4k front facing camera to try and get rid of some of that um but in the meantime how's it looking <laughs> so i'm off to my usual location uh, out for a, a little walk my uh, daily let's call it exercise <laughs> um but i wanted to first of all test in the car the audio of the phone itself before I put the lavalier go in and of course that front facing camera for the first time to see Ooh, the roads are so bad around here I don't know where you live is it the same there's potholes and grids and bumps and not just the speed bumps but actual just bumps in the road um, so I've got nice clean washed hair because I haven't tried anything on the camera yet I'm so excited to just I haven't done a slow fee. Like I've had this phone for three days and life just keeps getting in the way. And I didn't want my first uh, picture or slow fee that I took just to be one. <sighs> I wanted to be like, I want to be clean and fresh and not thinking about life and stress. I want a slow fee. And I want a video and I want to take pictures. So I'm heading out into the greenery on uh, 16 degrees. So it's nice and warm and dry um, September morning, but without that bright sunshine so hopefully um i have to put my sunglasses on there won't be any squinting and i can just see what effects this new iphone 11 has to offer because i tell you i'm so happy with just holding the phone just owning the phone um not just the color and the superficial things but the fact that this camera is so much more advanced than my 10 that i was using for previous vlogs um so the thing I've found now is I'm heading up to my usual walk and I'm leaving it on facing me, which is unfortunate for you, but because of the new wide angle, oh, these bumps, I'm so sorry, oh, but because of the new wide angle, when I turn it around for the position that I put the phone in to see me, um, it's ski whiff, it's, it's not quite right because obviously it's a larger phone and it's a larger angle, so I'm going to have to do reverse shots separately <laughs> um, there we go all parked up in my usual position I'm just about nine minutes into what I've filmed so oh, I've got back to dodgy lighting the Sun is really just shining out here now which um, yeah let's uh, take you out and discover what's happening okay so um, I have plugged in the lav now to see if that helps with any of the wind around and I've just parked up and this is the first part of the top trail just want to get a bit of that rustling and the lovely clouds I'm holding a loose big gorilla grip I've ended up putting the phone on so stabilization may not be brilliant as of course the floor isn't that straight <laughs> Able to get some of the clouds and the greenery, but uh, at the top here, it's all the it's going to go down this path. But change my mind, <laughs> kind of up past the top here and see if we can see the view. Get a bit of vista with those clouds, I mean, they do look beautiful. of zooms two and three Let's see how 
how that looks. Let's go ahead and swim back out and head on up this path to see what we can see. <laughs> Definitely look where you're going because there's um, little gifts from the horses on the floor. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to turn around the camera now. Get ready for the shock. <laughs> We're going to have my face in view. Let's see how that goes. <laughs> okay, there you have it. So I've uh, popped a hoodie on. Of course, my Adeline Morin hoodie. And I've let my hair free, ready for when I uh, attempt that slow fee. So um, there's a little bit of wind about. But it's nice. I'll be able to see how it catches the wispy bits with 4K. <laughs> All part of the test. I planned it that way, of course. <laughs> So uh, I don't know how steady my hand is, whether that's hindering the test of how good the video is, but I'm going to attempt to uh, turn around as well so you can see what I can see, how good. I think I might be looking in the wrong place. Sorry. <laughs> I kind of like the way that my hair is just flowing because I want to be able to uh, see what it catches. Apart from the fact it makes me look like a potato. <laughs> Let's see how that is. Just... Sometimes it's nice to have wispy hair <laughs> because it can have a wind test. <laughs> that wide angle though, I'm sure that is going to help many a vlog channel. <laughs> it's fantastic stuff. Okay, so enough of me looking at myself <laughs> in the screen. Let's get walking. <laughs> a little update time, as it were. So uh, when I started this channel, of course, I was uh, all ready to get fit and I started the couch to 5k. So let's address that first. <laughs> I did the first couple of weeks and <sighs> I don't know, it wasn't for me. I think maybe my head wasn't in the game. Um, I had every intention of being a saint and saying yes, come with me for the whole, is it five weeks or something, eight weeks, I can't remember now. Um, but I just didn't have it in me. And it wasn't that I was lazy, I still got out every day. That's why I wanted to say to you, I come for a walk every day. So I still get out in the fresh air, still um, get a little bit of exercise, but not in the couch to 5K way. <laughs> so it's still happening, it's still a journey. I've changed my eating habits and I've become a little more healthy. I've seen a few pounds difference on the scales, um, but I hope to obviously see more over the coming months. Um, I've completely missed hot girl summer, but I'm not prepared to have fat girl fall. So <laughs> I want to um, slim down before Christmas at least. And I know I've got a way to go, but I've also got a few months to do it in. So um, watch this space for that. Um, I would like to just show you what I can see now because I'm just deciding on which path to go down. So we've got um, two choices there. So it's also a chance for me to get my <laughs> camera in a different light and see what's happening here. Yeah, I told you, the sun shines on the right, you say. <laughs> of course it would come out when I said, oh, there's not much sun, but it's uh, glistening on my blonde. That's what I'm doing there, trying to see like the difference in my, my hair and my skin tone. It's like to me, it looks like it's changing. I'm going to see, obviously, when I watch it back, if it's picking up on that or if it's just something that's happening on the screen. So, left or right, which way do we go? Uh, well, I kind of want the adventure and head, where is it, down there, <laughs> rather than the ordinary path. Shall we take the adventurous route, see what we find? I think so. Okay, so I'm going to turn you around and, uh, oh, that was very close. <laughs> going to turn you around and let you see less of my uh, five chin situation. <laughs> Here goes.
of the, the path unknown <laughs> and uh, taking another path now so uh, just letting the wind hit there as and when as I said before um, have in the meantime might have seen already taken a few uh, slopies and tried the slow-mo out um, out and about real world slow-mo <laughs> So yeah, just popping back in to uh, show a bit of different lighting. The cloud cover has gone a bit more like it's going to rain now. So I wanted to just try and get back to the other place I want to be so I can take some pictures to insert over my talking. Because <laughs> I'm sure that's not what you want to be looking at, just me and the camera. You want to see what this camera does. So iPhone 11, you are magnificent. I've had fun in the last half an hour and I'm sure the next 12 months are going to be amazing. Sorry, I just wanted to get the, the other side as well. So a quick switch of angle to see how the green looks as well as uh, with the open skies. There, sneak peek. The blue wheel, the infamous walking spot. The top and took some pictures. Let's just put that hair in there. <laughs> we got some pictures and um, it started to rain. <laughs> so I'm heading back to the car. I don't know if you can uh, still get some of the, the cloud cover up there. That is awesome. Um, the greenery just, oh, so I'm going over these nails. <laughs> and hopefully the sound isn't affected by my hair touching this microphone all the time. It shouldn't be. Um, let's just head back into the the dry now. Uh, I'm going to sign off for now. I think that was a great first little test. Uh, nothing much to report about me and my life. Just loving the new camera and hopefully you'll see some of the uh, the clarity and the colours and you know the wisps of my hair and the, the fullness of the clouds. Those are the kind of things that I really wanted to get from this first look. When I get the gimbal out and give it a proper movie test that's when we'll see the uh, the movie gold but just as a little vlog i just wanted to uh, see how i held up i know the camera will be great but will i be good enough holding it and keeping you steady and not treading in a puddle <laughs> so really it was just a uh, a vlog test really with uh, the camera and my abilities so hopefully we both held up together and uh, you'll click on to the next video when it appears with a bit more of an in-depth of the camera and whatever I'm up to next. So um, I do have one final question though. Does anybody have any advice to stop that wobbling in the car? Because uh, I don't want to rely on the um, stabilization of my phone or trying to sort it out in post. I prefer the, the actual sticky thing in my window to not be I mean, it's a really good one. It's tight and secure, but if anyone's got a perfect solution or a better solution than what I've been using, um, yeah, let me know. 
let me know in the comments. I would like to have, I enjoy the car vlogs. I don't know about you. I enjoy talking when I'm in the car and I want you to be able to not be frustrated when you watch them. So uh, please let me know in the comments. I'll see you in the next video. Okay, so <laughs> I thought I was gonna end my vlog out on the walk and take a few pictures, insert those, let you see, obviously I've done on the way here, in the car, but what I wanted to just do was leave the, the lav mic attached whilst we're in the car and now see if there's a difference. Yeah, so the cloud cover is immense for pictures. I would love to do a time lapse of these right now but it's starting to rain and I don't really fancy being out somewhere um, so I'm heading somewhere else I don't know where yet I have a tank of petrol and I'm gonna figure it out on the way <laughs> but I want to take some more pictures and of course I wanted to pop in here now to test the lab whilst we're in the car so what do I want to say how does it look? Is it better? I think there's still some jitter, but hopefully the phone capabilities itself will help out with that. But um, I've asked this before, but please, if anybody knows like the genius solution to actually recording in the car, um, of course, I've mentioned before, I do have the Canon camera, but I don't have a way of fitting that in the car because I didn't come to fruition uh, with what I bought for that. And I'm having these shaky, car drive so with the clarity of this uh, 4k is obviously well I say obviously or presumably going to be a lot clearer but I would like it to be uh, still as well so fingers crossed that that is all gonna happen with this well this vlog actually okay so I'm gonna pop my music on now and head to who knows where but I'm sure there'll be some photographs and possibly some more of me rambling when I get there so see you on the flip side